up in the morning to you ladies, my name is Jacksepticeye and welcome back to 60 seconds We're on day 30 So according to the comments of before There should be 20 more days, but I don't know, we could get out sooner We could get out after this day, for all I know there, Who knows what's gonna happen The world is your oyster, do whatever the hell you want We didn't do anything about the infected wounds After all, our ancestors could survive without all that fancy medicine Yeah, and the dying ages were a lot lower than they are now Mortality ages, put it that way Fancy medicine, why should we listen to the doctors? Dolores is looking more sickly though. What doctors? We are so afraid for Timmy, but he came back from the wasteland and is safe with us now. Did he get anything? We quickly discover that the local supermarket has become the base of operations for a raider group. They are armed and dangerous. Some they leave to plunder, ransack the area. Even if it's risky, that was the best time to try and steal from them. Okay, so we got a rat away thing. I know that's not what it's called. That's a fallout thing, but I like calling that. Mary Jane is feeling safe. Who wasn't in this coffin sized shelter? Hey! That's a very nice coffin if that's what your coffin is. Other people were saying as well I should have left Mary Jane behind because she eats the most. And she doesn't really do a whole lot. Like Timmy's good for going out to the wasteland. Maybe. I don't know. Well he went out to the wasteland and he got this. Timmy is very hungry. Timmy isn't feeling very well. He's fatigued. He's tired. Life is hard. Blah blah blah. So everybody's good. Timmy just needs food. There you go. Should I heal you? I don't think so. No, we'll just do that. And we'll get out and we'll get ready to go. And maybe Ted will go out. We'll use this. The first aid kit we have is useless. We probably won't be able to fill it up with prescription meds from a drugstore. So we need to take matters into our own hands. Use that spray. Spray all of the shit. Spray your hair. Make it nice and stylish, like this. What do you know? Combining American innovation, innovation and deadly bug spray can result. Yeah, yeah, we got a new one. We should get Mary Jane something to drink. Not yet. Timmy is very hungry. You... I just fed you last time. Dolores should really have something to eat. Ted needs water. Okay, I'll feed Timmy once more. And that is it. And then everybody else will be fine until tomorrow. Um, Ted, you can head out. Head out and do the deeds. Maybe I should have fed you and watered you before you left. Is he gonna die? Hopefully not. Oh, God. What happened to you? Were you in a food fight? Did you go paintballing? Mary Jane's diet could use a little food. Mary Jane keeps fainting. Okay, so you need food. Timmy should eat something, really? Timmy's in terrible shape. We need to give him water now. Dolores hasn't eaten for a while. Oh, Fuck it, food and water for everybody. I don't care anymore. Just get me out of this stupid bomb shelter. We decided to have some fun. You don't have a saxophone down here. Can you play a tune on the rifle? Maybe stick it in your face and blow your head off? Sorry, that's that's a bit mean. I, I love you really, but I mean stop eating all my food. You are sick. And I don't mean sick, it's like, damn bro, you're sick. We played truth or dare when it turned out we only kept asking, okay, I answered all these already. Timmy has rested. Mary Jane is fine. Dolores could really love to eat something. Yeah, but I'd really love less of your sass. So just go fuck yourself. Tentacles? Tentacles everywhere! Is that a monster from Mars? No, it's probably just something from Japan. Wait, they're not tentacles. It's the damn plant Mary Jane is growing. It is mutated and is out of control. Are those teeth? It's like a fucking little house of horrors. That singing Venus flytrap. Can't remember his name. Did he have a name? There was nothing we could use to fight that damn plant. We're lucky it didn't eat us alive, but it did steal, did steal some of our, of our food. Ah, uh, speak Ingly. In what reality does a plant eat it? <laughs> a can of tomato soup, great. It's always better when things are calm. Mary Jane is fine. Timmy was cured. You're looking grand. You were hungry a minute ago, and now you're fine. I don't get you, people. A traveling salesman paid us a visit today. He introduced himself as Willie. Haha, <laughs> what a name. Apparently, business can do well even after the end of the world. One can in exchange for cards, a bottle of water in exchange for the checkerboard. Two cans for the gas mask and four for the gun. I get rid of the checkerboard because at least we still have cards. So we got more food then, right? We're gonna survive, right? Can I turn on the radio and hear for backup? I made a deal with the salesman. One bottle of water. Okay, good, because I was running low on water. Everyone has to drink sometimes, including Mary Jane. Is there any water left? Timmy doesn't need much, but he should drink. No, you'll, you'll survive till tomorrow. You'll be fine. Relax. I know what I'm doing. I have managed people before. Shine your boots and hoist the flag. The army's on the radio again. No! Fuck! Can I not 
be saved? Oh, Ted. Is that a tie or a sock from your neck? <laughs> the signal has to wait. Besides, do they even know how much flashlight batteries cost? Especially in this economy. Ted is safely returned. Our little trip to the surface might have been spotted and followed. We should be more careful next time. Ted! You son of a bitch! Why did you get caught? We are not alone outside the shelter. At first, it seemed like the creature stalking us was about to get himself a tasty dinner. To our relief, it turned out to be a friendly monkey. It joined our expedition. <laughs> At one point during our expedition, blah blah blah, monkey started making weird sounds and blah blah blah, digging in front of us with a stick. Quick investigation revealed a few bottles of water. We got a bottle of water! Yeah! You need to drink. You need to drink. You need to drink. And Ted needs food. Okay. Food, water, water, water. Nice! We won't go for another expedition just yet, we'll wait. And we're gonna use a book to beat the shit out of the cockroaches. Our hideout was approached by a man we didn't know. He claimed he used to be an accountant, but now he survives as a trader and a gambler. He offered us a card game for a bet of two water bottles. Shall we play? Play it up. But we have three water bottles. If two go away, we'll have another one. Fuck! <laughs> we suck at cards, don't we? I immediately saw the fucking two bottles were gone. God, fuck it! We have like a quarter of a can of soup, one water bottle, y'all are gonna die. Damn it! That man must have cheated. We lost and before we could argue about it, the man left with our supplies. You have a gun! Use it! Mary Jane is quite hungry. Everyone has to drink sometimes. Am I let Mary Jane die? <laughs> Fuck! Hopefully I can get through 10 more days. That's hoping that I actually escape on day 50. Mary Jane is quite hungry. Mary Jane keeps fainting. Mary Jane should probably just realize that she's not useful to the group and should just die. I'm sorry. A lot of you probably love Mary Jane, don't you? And uh, you're getting angry at me because I'm threatening to kill her. I'm getting the cabin fever. I'm getting the island madness inside a bomb shelter. Timmy went out to the wasteland. Who cares? The Lords will not survive without water. Ted is hungry. You're hungry, but maybe the water will fill your belly? It is very difficult to prepare for unforeseen consequences when you don't see them coming. Well, they are unforeseen by definition, so that does not make a lot of sense. We can't say we are prepared for what. What? Is Mary Jane going to be dead? No, she's still alive. She's resilient. Living in the past is not wise in our current situation. We need to think of today and tomorrow. Mary Jane's diet could use a little food. Mary Jane keeps fainting. We need to get her something to drink fast. Everybody else is fine. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. I want cake. I want cake too. We're pretty sure Mary Jane had her birthday two weeks ago, but it turns out it's today! Shall we get her something a young lady trapped inside the shelter would enjoy? Yeah, here's a load of cards. Go play with them. I shouldn't have given her the cards. Should have just let her die. <laughs> See, yep, she dead. <laughs> Oops! When Mary Jane found out she is not getting a single drop of water, she got furious. She stormed out into the wasteland, shouting over her shoulder that we'll regret this, and that she's getting her water one way or another. We are seriously terrified now. She's gonna come back with like an army of cockroaches and kill us. Mary Jane loves cards. We thought she might get herself busy with solitaire, but she started doing card readings. Um, and then she left. Ted is hungry. Yeah, there we go. There's the last of the food. Timmy's back and he brought food and water. Timmy, you're a fucking legend. We figured the best way to be sure of nothing, and no one jumps at us inside this mysterious room, was to bash the door open and start firing. When the smoke was gone, we were able to assess our operation. Assess looks like asses. <laughs> the room was empty. We hit nothing but the walls, and we barely dodged one ricochet gone bad. Great. We were so afraid for Timmy, but he came back from the wasteland and is safe with us now. Thank God Mary Jane didn't get to him. We believe that our expedition to the wasteland must have been followed by strangers. We should be more cautious next time. Does it matter? What was that? Is it a bird? Is it a sock broker? <laughs> Is it a bike bicycle repairman? No! It's the air raid aid airdrop. I thought it was air raid drop. That was an excellent time to leave the bunker in search of supplies. Nice one, bruh. Okay, we got a lot of shit. We got a gas mask as well. Timmy should eat, he's really tired. No, these guys first. You guys should eat and drink first, and you'll be fine. Timmy can last another day. Um no, we'll wait another one. This is it! We've officially gone too long without a flashlight. If we don't fix it and play Shadow Bunny soon, somebody will snap and we don't know blah blah blah. Read a book. You'll be fine. I'm sorry I keep blah blah blahing everything, but to say the same things over and over again. The wasteland is full of surprises, like this man on the other side of our door knocking and claiming that he's willing to offer a lot for decent ammunition. Shall we trade? Yes. I'm way too trusting of people. 
It's a flaw. I'm way too nice, damn it. <laughs> I'm way too fucking nice. <laughs> we didn't get anything, did we? Oh! We got a can of soup. Okay, that's fine. We don't- we have no ammo. Hopefully we'll survive. A visitor was happy to get some ammunition in return he offered us rations. It wasn't much, but something is always better than nothing. Didn't he say he had great things? He a liar. He a big old liar. You need water, hunger. I'ma leave you guys fine for now. I am gonna spit all over my leg though. Day 48. Are we good? Are we surviving? We thought playing the silent game would be a good idea. The silence is too annoying and we quickly stopped. <laughs> Timmy, Timmy is hungry. Ah, so am I. Dolores will not survive without water. Ted looks like he's got one foot in the grave and needs to drink. So you guys need water and Timmy needs to eat. I know I could probably ration them out a lot better, but... Why... Dolores, you go out. You haven't been out. What are we going outside for? I don't know, but hopefully we survive this. Day 49. We're getting close to half a century of days. <laughs> Dolores was killed. What? What? Oh, no. Well, if we've ever had a bad idea, this excursion definitely makes the top five list. Everything was going well until we realized it's a velociraptor herd. What? <laughs> or something like that looked like one of them. Even if it weren't, even if they weren't, their hunger for flesh was equal. Fuck's sake. Man! Ted is not complaining today, at least not very much. Maybe because his wife is dead. Maybe he never loved her in the first place. <laughs> the military is transmitting again. We don't have a flashlight! I'm gonna die here, aren't I? I- Oh, Ted. Ted, you're not looking well. <laughs> That's the face of a mad bastard if ever I've seen one. The signal has to wait besides blah 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 batteries. Yeah, Ted has gone crazy. Great. Timmy needs water though. I'm not gonna survive this. I'm not gonna survive this. I don't have the items anymore. We died. Oh! Our safe haven was invaded by a filthy vulgar band of thugs. The look in their eyes did not promise anything good. If we only held out a bit longer, maybe the military would have rescued us. Maybe, but we didn't have anything. 50 days. We survived 50 days and then we died. Great, what happened to Timmy? What did you guys do to him? That doesn't really feel good enough for a video. I mean, it could make a video on its own, but I want to survive. I want to go back in and see if I can survive. I probably won't do it in this episode because 50 days is a long time. Hopefully we got good supplies this time as well. Pretty good. We have a lot of soup. Why couldn't you just put them up in the shelf? We've got big water jug as well. Uh, we have an axe. We have no flashlight. Fuck. We need a flashlight to military. All of us made the shelter just a second for the blast. Yeah, this is all the same. Always. Every single time. So everybody's fine for the first day. He'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Might make Mary Jane die straight away. I don't know. We might we might be okay without her. You grew a beard already. We were discussing plans for our first meal that didn't feature tomato soup, and we heard yells outside. We discovered they came from a small group of ragged survivors. They were a sh they were a sorry sight, and we weren't surprised when they requested aid. They asked us to provide anything we could: water, food, or medical supplies. I'm not giving them anything. I'm going on without giving them anything. The last few times I've trusted people, they've given me shit. Oops! Our refusal to provide for our visitors was not rude, and yet, the minute we denied their request, they launched at us with their fists, stones, and branches. We thought we were as good as dead, but those barbarians were satisfied enough to steal our supplies. When they left, all we could do was ponder what to do in this very empty shelter. The end. <laughs> How'd you guys die? <laughs> When Mary Jane found out she is not getting a single drop of water, she got furious, she stormed out. Timmy is insane. He opened a shelter door and ran away without looking back. He's not likely to return. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Ted... Uh, Dolores died of dehydration last night. Ted died of dehydration. <laughs> Surviving the apocalypse is no easy task. We can tell you that much. I did so bad! Okay, well that does it for this video on 60 seconds. Let me know if you guys want to see more of it. I will keep trying if people want to see to try and survive out the entire thing. I did the tutorial, which was only a few days. It was only like 20, wasn't it? Um, I might try and keep doing that over and over again. I, I'm not sure about going in and getting my own supplies again. I might just keep picking the... 
This one, the survival on its own, the easy one, and try and do that. If I can't do that, then I can't do any of them. Scavenging for supplies is really, really hard to do. And I always run out of time and take the wrong things. So, next time, maybe, we'll see what we can do. I will survive. Let me know. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, punch the like button in the face. Like a boss. And, I eyes all around. Whoosh, whoosh. But thank you guys, and I will say all your nudes. Hi! Hey guys! Hi! I'm a dog! <laughs> ho ho ho! I'm Santa Claus, bitch! Look at my teeth! Smile! Smile though your heart is- Everybody died. Except Jack boy! I'm still here. I survived. I can survive any sort of apocalypse. You think something's gonna take me down that easily? No!